Not to be rude or anything, but I like you. <laughs> Dobby, <laughs> shush, I'm sorry. I, I didn't mean to offend you or anything. Oh, don't mind that. It's just the bloody pigeon. You just ruined the punchline of my Japanese golfer joke. That's crazy! Dobby hoped if Harry Potter thought his friends had forgotten him, Harry Potter might not want to go back to school. Give me back those letters now. And first, you have to go with me, sir. Please, no. Are you my dear? I'm fine, thank you. I'm Can we ask? We'll you back. Oh, please. Have a seat. What do you think you're doing down here? Come on! You're a mess, Harry. Skulking round here, liners on. Touch it, please. Don't want no one to see you there. People are thinking you're no good. What were you doing down there then? Me? Oh, I was, um, I was looking for a flesh-eating slug repellent. Aha. Uh -huh. What did you do to your glasses? <laughs> I found a cadaver! I definitely need to remember that one. You will see a disgrace to the name of wizard. wizard. If, if they, they don't even pay you well for it. We have a very different idea about what disgraces the name of wizard, Malfoy. Scabbers, you're okay. Kill him! You were seen by no less than seven and three quarters muggles. Honestly, Professor Snape. Silence! These boys have flouted the decree for the restriction of underage wizardry. As such. I am well aware of our bylaws, Severus, having written quite a few of them myself. We'll go and get our stuff then. You're going to expel us, aren't you? Yes. Today, we're going to re-pop pop. Who here can tell me the properties of pop? Yes, Miss Granger. Excellent. Ten points to Gryffindor. Now, as our mandrakes are still only seedlings, their cries won't knock you out for several hours yet, but they could kill you. <laughs> right, on we go. Plenty of pop to go around. Call me a mudblood. Well, of course you are. First, and understand this, Harry, because it's very important. There's some wizards who are better than everyone else because they're pure blood. Hermione can do. Get out of my house, Hermione. You dirty blood. Muggle-born. Push me around. Well, maybe they'd be better off if I wasn't around. What's that? How we buy the Zimlet? We only squeeze from it. It's written in blood.
you murdered my cat. Go. Could I have your attention, please? Today, puberty. Like so. One, two, three. Ferraverto. What exactly does legend tell us lies within the chamber? It is said to be the home of a mom. One, two, three. Avada Kedavra. <laughs> An excellent idea to show them that, Professor Snape. He's still alive! The killing curse. Only one person is known to have survived it. And he's in this room. Me. Perhaps it would be prudent to first kill the students. An excellent suggestion, Professor Snape. I don't understand. I heard you speaking. The black speech of Mordor. It was cat hair I plucked off Millicent Bulstrobe's robes. My cat. Go. Does it mean anything to either of you? No. If, um, if anybody was looking for some stuff, then all they'd have to do would be to follow the spiders. It is said to be the home of a mom. The black speech of Mordor. It won't save you now, Potter. It only obeys me. Your bird may have blinded the basilisk, but it can still hear you. Liar! <laughs> Stop flapping your wings like a drunken pelican. Like I'm pretty valuable to have around. <laughs> you both realize, of course, that in the past few hours, you have broken perhaps a dozen school rules. Yes, sir. And there is sufficient evidence to have you both expelled. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Therefore, it is only fitting that you both receive a most painful death. Everyone is so unhappy with me When I try to do my best They treat me like a pest Well, maybe They'd be better off if I was